Happy Thanksgiving to everyone. I'm absolutely excited here. I'm just um, taking time out to um, share with my um, audience here. You know, one thing about what I have to say tonight is be careful when you think your friends, your co-workers, and everybody who got your back, they're going to be the ones who put the knife in your back. You know, and you have to be strong enough to overcome the backstabbing and the, the, the deceitfulness that they're going to try to plant in your life to try to cause you to be frustrated and get you off track and change your different tonality about who you are as an individual. Don't trust your friends. Don't trust your co-worker. Don't trust your family when it comes to establishing yourself and building on what you need to do to get to the next level. Because they got the biggest knives and they're very sharp. As soon as you think that they're with you, they're going to show you with the backstab how much they're against you. Don't be discouraged because there's 24 hours in a day this video is about them 24 hours in a day. Now, this is the issue that you have to overcome. Most people are frustrated and they're scared to death. And they listen to the social media, CNN, and all the other news media to control their 24 hours in a day. When you get in your mind that you can overcome, the news media is not control your 24 hours. Negative friends is not control your 24 hours, and them low life co workers that you work with is not control your 24 hours. Not all. I got like three or four of my job that I really love to death. I give them wine, I give them everything I need to show them that I appreciate them because sometimes you need that person to see that life is about enjoying yourself. Yeah, I got like three or four people that I share my circle with. You know, Patricia Johnson, Sanders, and White, Lucas. These are my real friends, my wife. So you, you got friends, then you got real friends. I'm gonna tell you something about real friends. When you got real friends, if things go wrong, you can rely on them. When you know you're wrong, you can argue with them. But then two days later, y'all still friends, them real friends. I appreciate Patricia Johnson, White, Sanders, and Lucas, especially on my job. Everybody else got a life as Biggest Samson trying to destroy me. This is for all them haters on the job. And then this toast is for the four friends I just mentioned. I appreciate y'all. It's Thanksgiving. And one thing I'm thankful for. New life. New friends. My four friends. That's close to me. That I know. That I can get them a drink. We can take a drink. And we can talk about whatever. You have to have somebody who have your back. Because so many people with knives in your back. Now I want to talk about those 24 hours. There's 24 hours in a day. And everyone will try to control your 24 hours. You got people that's on joke time. Everything's a joke to them. I'm not about joking all day long. It's okay to have a joke. One or two, three or four or five. But life is not a joke. Because life circumstance going to show up. And then, you need real friends who understand life circumstance. That you can go to and binge out to. Like a Patricia Johnson. Um, Sanders. White. Lucas, my brother, my wife. See, I can vent out to them. You know why? Because 
they don't have no cut cars. They're going to disagree. They're going to tell you what's right, what's wrong. They'll give you tough love. Now, moving forward, I'm going to continue to elaborate on the 24 hours a day. Most people are frustrated because when they look at their 24 hours on a Monday, and here it is a Tuesday, and nothing changed from Monday and Tuesday, and then you go all the way out and do everything you can do beyond expectation to make things happen. People do not like when you make things happen in your 24 hours. They become haters, and they become judgmental. But you have to have control and understand success is a process. And the process started with you understanding your limitations. Now, with that being said, I'm going to move on to the credit repair service. So I have to touch, before I touch on the credit repair service, I got to take a drink. And this drink is in Grandma Yay, some little bit of wine. And some during hen dog. You know why? When you deal with the people I deal with eight hours a day on my job, you need to take a drink. Because if you don't take a drink, it's going to drive you crazy. Let's talk about credit. The credit industry has expanded some tremendously. I got so many people who started a credit repair company. They're helping people with credit service and getting the credit straight. That's a good thing because you cannot do anything if you don't have your credit straight. But I just wanted to encourage you that once you get your credit straight to the credit industry, to the people that I'm merging with, one thing you have to understand, once your credit is prepared and you're straight, no one can take care of you but you. Then some other things that you have to get in place. See, let's just talk about the insurance. You got home insurance, car insurance, life insurance, all kinds of insurance. See, we have a care plan that will put all them insurance policy in place where you can organize yourself. See, it's one thing to get your credit straight, then you have to organize. You have to be organized while your credit is straight. And the only way you can get organized is that you have to take time out to put a system in place to organize. That's what I want to talk about. With FES, we have some phenomenal things going on. We got a convention coming up in um, February. And I challenge you, if you're dealing with your car insurance, your home insurance, credit, all kinds of debt, traveling everywhere, you need to get a system in place where it can help you to organize yourself. And if you go to FESConvention.com, you can see where you can connect with people. See, your net income is based on your net worth. If you got people who make more income than you, then you need to surround yourself with people making most income than you. Because if you surround yourself with people who just think like you, you know what they're going to do? All they're going to do is talk negative and bring you down. It's time to lift yourself off the ground and be like that eagle and expand. I'm absolutely excited about the expansion. I'm absolutely excited about you. I'm absolutely excited about this holiday. But most thing I'm absolutely excited about is that the 24 hours in a day, you control. What are you doing with your 24 hours? See, some people become haters because most people can manage their 24 hours better than you can, and then they have progress, and then you think, oh, they just in a pyramid scheme, they're getting rich and all kinds of negative stuff. Stop putting yourself in that type of funnel. Understand one thing. Life is all about challenges. Take a shot. Be encouraged. Keep on working on yourself. Develop your skills and move to action. And I'm telling you right now, if you go to FESConvention.com and take action, we all can grow together and I can show you just spinning and celebrating a weekend together going to change your life. I'm looking forward to the ones who want to change their life in February the 8th to the 10th to connect, merge with me, and let's go out to Las Vegas, have a good time, party, have some drinks.